the art of poetry. I've just had a, a, a message from, from somebody who started following the, the YouTube channel, The Poor Demented Soul. And he said that it's kind of inspired him a little bit to write his poetry. And as I did, this is take two, as I did, was doing take, uh, take one, he, uh, he pinged a message uh, saying about the vulnerability of poetry. And he's a songwriter. And it's almost as if musicians, they use sometimes, and this is nothing against musicians, it doesn't matter about the words, how you get there, what matters is that you perform, what's in your heart. You know, it's sometimes a shield. As a teacher, as a Kung Fu teacher, it's, it's easy to hide behind that role of being a teacher. But a poet, they do. We, we, we lay our hearts on the line. People will ridicule us for our words and laugh at our words. Of course, Volgon yelts. So here we go. This poem is Me, Myself and I. I've lived a lot of life in two score and four years. I've known a lot of strife, but there's more I got right. I've loved and lost more than I care to recall. To such a point, I tend to ignore the flowers waiting in the hall. Now I wonder at those wasted chances. Idealistic plans and all the fruits I never tasted as one of life's also runs. So here I stand once again, the past behind, the future forever unborn, and the heart aware of the game that the winds of chance play with the attachments I've so easily borne. I may have lived, loved and lost a lot, but we all stand on the edge of a brighter tomorrow. Through all this confusion there's one thing I've learned, and that's how to love the only thing I've truly got. Nothing else, no one else, for all else is just illusion and the only reality is little old self-contented me.